Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking you through the LCO method. So I like to use the LCO method the further along I am in my relaxer stretch and if my hair's feeling especially dry. For me it just gives my hair that extra moisture it needs to avoid breakage and it just makes my hair a lot more manageable. So right now I'm at 11 weeks post. In this video I'm just going to talk you through it and show you how I do it on my relaxed hair. So if you're following me on Instagram, you would have seen that I'm kickstarting my hair journey again and I am actively trying to grow my hair to waist length once again. So I did a little bit of shopping last week and I've just bought some products that used to work for me in the early days of my hair journey and I've decided to try some new products that I've seen great reviews of. So I'll be using some of those products today. What is the LCO method? So essentially the LCO method is adding a step in between moisturising and sealing. The L stands for a liquid or leave-in, C stands for cream, and the O is oil. So essentially you start by applying a liquid or leave-in to your hair, layering it up with a moisturiser or a cream, and then adding an oil to seal. So today for my liquid I'll be using the Root to Tip Miracle Moisture Milk. Now this is a product I used to use years ago, I'm not entirely sure why I haven't replaced it like since the last time it ran out, but this is what I'll be using as my liquid and I've just transferred some of it into this spray bottle. For the cream, it, I'm trying a new product which I just started using this week but I really love it and the combination makes my hair feel very moisturised. Like this is what I used on my hair last night. So it's the As I Am Double Butter Cream Rich Daily Moisturiser. For the oil, I'm going to be using this little mixture I made which contains coconut oil, avocado oil and olive oil. So that's just mixed up in this little bottle here. So. I'll just start by parting my hair in two. Like I said, I like to use the LCO method the further along I am in my relaxer stretch. So that is why I use the little spray bottle. I find it's easier to apply to my new growth that way. The moisture milk actually comes with a little nozzle top, so you can also just apply it straight to your roots. So I just make sure it's just applied evenly to my new growth. And then I go ahead and get the bottle and just Squirt some in my hand. Make sure I focus on the ends. And then I simply layer up with the moisturizer. Oh my god, this smells so good. So just a small amount. That will do. And I just kind of work my way up. You can just part it again just to get in there a bit more. At this point I'll take my wide tooth comb and just kind of work through my hair. So that already feels very moist. Then I just take the oil, I just put a little bit in my hand and then go over the area with the oil. And that is that section done. Like, I feel like you can see how moisturized it looks. It really does feel it. So that is one section done. Then I just do that for the rest of my hair. Now one thing to take note of with this method is if you are wearing your hair straight, um, like as in you've used heat to straighten it, then this method will make your hair revert, um, the liquid obviously will make it revert. So avoid this if you're trying to just enjoy your straight hair. It does work really well for braid outs, it helps give your hair that extra definition.
can see, my hair is very well moisturized. Like, it just looks like it's shining. It was also really easy to detangle my new growth. So that is one of the benefits. So at this point, I would just either plait my hair, probably plait it again tonight, and rock a little braid out in the morning. So that is the LCO method. I hope you enjoyed that little demo. And if you enjoyed that video, then give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more videos like this, then make sure you leave me a comment and let me know what you want to see next. Guys, thanks for watching this video, and I will see you again in the next one. I know you do.